Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. We are here in my Skinny Classic Happy Planner for the week of August 10th. I am using a new sticker book from the Happy Planner. Actually, I don't know exactly how new it is to them. I think it is pretty new. Uh, brand new to me, I've never used it before. It's the Layered Florals book. Um, and the pages that we're going to use, <clears throat> excuse me, are these ones here. So I just thought these looked so, so summery and cute. And there is a lot that we could do with these. So I'm excited to see what we come up with. Let's grab these off the discs. You will notice I did cover up the um, sort of pink leopard print with some sticker paper. You can still see it faintly through, but I don't think it's gonna be too noticeable once, um, once all the elements are down on the page. So the first thing is that I want to use this. I think I want to put it here. So I'm not sure if I want to put it in the corner or on this line. I think, ooh, ooh. I think probably the corner. Um, I'm fine that it covers up the date. I am gonna know which week we're in. <laughs> okay, and then I was thinking the other one up here. Let's see what we think. Um, it's going to show the 2020 through it. I'm fine with that. It doesn't really bother me. Oh, how cute. I love it already. Okay, I think what I'm going to do next is use this. Whoops. And I'm going to put some here. I don't know that that's actually going to go the whole way across the next page. Maybe I'll trim it there. Yeah. Like that. And then some down here. Uh oh. And then underneath here, I want to put a big flower, like in this notes part. Not the pink one, because I think that'll be too much pink. Maybe this one. I'm going to grab some wax paper. Um, I'm thinking this. And then you got this. I think that might look really cute. So like that. I think that works.
There we go. Always keep your little bits of um, like clear flowers and leaves and stuff that you pull that you cut off the side because you can always use it to fill in the edges a little bit more. All right, next, let's pull in. So I'm gonna pull this color in um, on this side of the page. I just need, actually that one might be perfect. Uh, actually maybe not. Probably this one I'm holding will be the best one. So I just need to find, I think one of these. So, there and then I think this one All right, now I am going to need a box, like a full box, down here. And I'm thinking maybe this one, because it has room to write in more than one space. So, like three little bullet points, I mean. in a bit as well. Okay. I will need bullet points and I don't know yet what I'm going to use for those. But first let's find something to go I feel like it needs to go the other way, although I thought it was a square. I think it is a square. Why does it feel like it should go this way? Maybe it's not the right one. I'm going to put that back. I'm going to grab colorful boxes because we have gold foil in here and I have tons and tons of gold boxes that I never use and I think this is the perfect opportunity to use some of them. Hmm. 
actually, instead of that one, let's do, let's do two of these ones. I don't know actually if we'll get two on here without it looking really strange. that looks all right this one I want to move in a bit it's too there I think that looks a little better let's take this and put it Okay, and then we will do um not another today though. We'll do a remember on Monday, but we'll pull in another one of these. Put that one there and then bullet points would go there if I can find any I just pulled out an old planner basics because I know in this book there are some like little asterisk type things that might be the right colors I don't know. All the food, so cute. Yeah, like some of these I think could work. Where's my wax paper? I think that pink could work if I needed it to. Oops. I don't even need to do that because this page is already out. Uh, that's almost the right blue, so that could work. I don't think I need any. Uh, it's not quite the same. Those are, they're just smaller, hearts, maybe, here, these ones, those ones, I'll bring them anyway, at this point, this book is so ruined, with the binding that I don't, I'm just not fussed if it, if it all gets pulled apart. Yeah. Okay. That can all go back together afterward. All right. So 
What do we have here? The hearts, I don't know if I'm going to use this time. These are tiny, tiny little ones. I don't know about those. Um, I'm thinking these ones. Do I want to bring in any of the clear ones, though? If I did... Feel like the other ones, I'm sure they're actually, I know they're exactly the same size because I can tell, but I feel like I like these ones better. These are just a little bit too maybe primary color feeling to me. There is some dark green that I think could possibly work. Um, this color will work. I don't have any of the blue in there, like the blue flowers, even though I think it's absolutely gorgeous. I'll probably stay away from that a little bit. Let's do I have three dark green ones. Let's do one. Two and three. Maybe yellow here. Or um, maybe this coral color, because it is, I th yeah, I don't think that'll clash. Sort of orangey. Let's do yellow on Saturday. Okay, and then Sunday, Sunday, Sunday. I guess we can use these light pink ones. They won't clash entirely. Just two, yeah. I don't like that there's a line all the way down here. Um, I'm going to put these over here. And then I'm going to find something to go here. I don't hate that there for some reason. I think I am going to leave this one here, but I'm going to put it up like that. Maybe? No. No, no. Okay, I still need something here. This looks a little out of place to me, but I feel like I'm going to leave it. <laughs> maybe something here okay I'm wondering if I can get this up I don't know what to do down here I think this needs to come up so we put that there I wonder if I could put in one of these. Okay, that's going to work. 
We just need to get it in straight. Okay, we're going to leave that like that. I still feel like I need something little here, but I honestly have no idea what to put. All right, let's move these one more time. Let's take this. Okay, and then I'm going to do one more. And then um, maybe I'll bring back one of those. <clears throat> All right, I think that is good. This, I mean, it looks out of place, but I don't know. I don't hate it. I don't know if there's somewhere else that I could put it, though. Okay, I'm going to put it there, but I'm going to put a little further down um, so that the leaves don't cover as much of this. Actually, that probably won't work in this instance because it doesn't have, um, they're both cut edges now. But this one, I can probably pop back down. There we go. Okay, I think it's important to know when to stop. <laughs> so I think that's going to be what I do now. Let's put all this away and grab our discs again. <clears throat> and let's see what we think. Yeah, I think that that is good. I am happy with that. Functional enough, pretty enough. A um, little bit of gold foil on both pages. I think it'll do. I hope that you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up, consider subscribing, and don't forget to check me out over on Instagram and Etsy at A Pretty Planscape. I'll see you all again soon. Bye, friends.